this one, this one really hits different. This one really, 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 really hurts. Um, Chadwick Boseman. <laughs> wow, that's something that I never expected to even come across. I, I went to the bathroom at like 12 o'clock this morning. And, of course, you pick up your phone to see if you got any text or any notifications from anybody. And the first thing I see when I open Instagram is a picture of Chaz Bowen, uh, old Bozeman. And I'm sitting here like, why? What is it his birthday or something? Did I miss something? Because I wasn't reading the captions. I saw, like, the Black Panther and him posing like this. And you know all of that, so I didn't. I, li I didn't look too much into it. And as I was going through social media, as I was going through YouTube, my favorite YouTube channel, some of my favorite YouTubers, I was going on their communities pages. I was going on um, some people that I knows, you know, Instagrams and Snapchats. I, I, I was seeing rest in peace. I'm, I'm looking over here like rest in peace. What you mean rest in peace? Uh, rest in peace no sorry my ear no this can't be happening no not 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 him not 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 chadwick no not our black panther no he he starred in 21 bridges gods of egypt the avengers black panther avengers in game avengers infinity war he was supposed to have his solo movie not chadwick and 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 what when, when i was reading up all on all of this information my man had cancer the whole time he was shooting most of these movies and you would have never even thought that he was sick <laughs> like this this hits me hard like Nipsey Hussle's death hit me. Like, I couldn't sleep after this. I, I, feel, I feel terrible for this man's family, for his wife and his family to be at his bedside as they watch the life leave his body. Like, this really, because he, Chad, Chadwick, was one, one of the many artists that, that inspired me to keep pushing to keep showing my talent, to keep doing what I love, to just, just to keep up with it, because it's, it's a lot more to life than struggle. You can perfect your craft by being the best you that you can be. You know, and I'm sitting here reading this, and I'm like, say what you want about Gods of Egypt, but he played that role phenomenal. Say what you want about Black Panther, but he played that role phenomenal. 21 Bridges I enjoyed. Some of his other movies that I don't know the names of off the top of my head that I seen him in. He was in a movie about um, baseball. I forgot the name of that movie. You know, this man, was a, this man was a talent. And it's like, yo, 2020, what the hell is up with you? What, what, what's going on with you? But I, 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 you know, he he died. He passed away of colon cancer, and that that has something to do with your intestinal tract, your large intestinal tract. And I, I and and until today, I didn't even know that there was a such thing as colon cancer. I didn't know that it was that serious. Oh my God! This. Uh, I don't know what to even think. I can't even envision anyone else playing T'Challa. Any, I can't. I, I can't fathom anyone else taking over that home of playing Black Panther. He is my Black Panther. Every time I read a comic book that has to do with Black Panther, I read it in his voice, or I read it how he would read it. I, I see him in that role. You know. It's just 43 years old. I got, thank God I made it to 23. He's 43 years old and he was taken. He, he seemed to be at the prime of his career and he was taken. I hate doing videos like this, man. Because I did a video on uh, Nipsey uh, over a year ago when he passed. Well, not over a year ago. It was, it was pretty recent when his wife did a, a, a inspirational video on him. It got copyrighted, of course, because of the music. But hey, I didn't really care. This, I'm not adding, 
I'm not adding ads or anything. I'm not collecting any money off of this at all because you know this this is a this is a legacy, one of the many legacies that have to be talked about and have to be passed down. You should want especially as black men and women, you should want to aspire to be as talented and as humble and as caring as this man was. You know, you watch a lot of interviews and he just had that aura that you gravitate towards. I read Kevin Feige said he 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 be on set and and he just he just leaked charisma. He leaked, you know, or he had that aura about him that made people want to come back. He embodied the people that he was playing on screen down to the T. I, I just I can't freaking believe this. And it's like really 2020. Do you have no mercy at this point? Especially for the good. You have people out here doing terrible, horrible things. You have people doing evil shit. And they're still alive. Collecting a giant check. Being influencers, being people that people follow behind. You have those people living on, living their best life, but you have good and caring people dying early and young. Why? Why? Why, why, why is that even a thing? No one should lose their life. I'm not saying that there should be people to die because of what they do. Everybody has to meet their maker one day. But when I look at the the the, the means that the meets the ends, it's just like you have politicians, you have celebrities that don't deserve an ounce of what they have. And I don't care that you've worked for it your whole life. There's 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 a thing of working for it your whole life, getting it and not treating the people or your country like complete dog shit. Don't rub it in people's faces. Don't flaunt your wealth because there are actually people out here struggling and hurt. I didn't know that this man was sick for as long. He was so private and he posted a picture a while ago. And I was I was looking at it like, why is he so damn skinny? But I was reading through it and people were like, nah, he's getting ready for a role that he's about to shoot. I didn't think too much of it. Fast forward to today and the man lost his life due to cancer. I'm just, yo, Chad Bozeman, man, rest in peace. I, I, with the sincerity in my heart coming from my, my, my Norse necklace, rest in peace and I hope wherever you go, whether it be Valhalla, heaven, wherever it is and whatever, whatever religious views that you had or that any of us have, may you rest in peace and may you enjoy your time in the afterlife because you truly deserve it. You may have done some wrong in life, younger, little bit older. You may have done some wrong, but we're all human. Who, who said that we weren't allowed to make mistakes? Rest in peace, man. Rest in peace. And if YouTube does auto-generate ads, because they usually do sometimes, if they do auto-generate ads, I'm going to find a way to donate the revenue to a, a, to a, a research that, that researches issues that has to do with cancer and all of that. This man, this man went to kids that had cancer and gave them hope. I just can't even fathom this. Like this is crazy. I can only aspire to be as 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 good of a man as he was. I aspire to be like my grandfather was. I aspire to be like Jason Momoa was. I aspire to be like Paul Walker was. People Nipsey Hussle. People that I look up to. And I don't get starstruck too often. But if I if I met any of these men, I would have to sit down and just have a conversation. No pictures, no camera, no nothing. Just sit and talk. Because these are the people that I want to mold myself after for my family and for the professions that I wanna that I wanna pursue. Rest in peace, man. Rest in peace. 43 years old. May your soul be in everlasting peace. That's all I can say. You guys, let me know in the comments section how he impacted your life as a as a man of color or a, a woman of color or just anyone in general it doesn't have to even be of color you could be white you can be yellow you could be red you could be anything just let me know how this man impacted you and and let me know how he inspired you to be a better you also um 
I have updates coming for the for the channels that I'm starting. I'm starting a gaming. I'm starting a podcast channel. This channel, t-shirt company. <sighs> this just this just motivated me. Although we lost a life, this just motivated me. While losing a life, we gained lives. There were probably babies that were born on this day too. You you can't look at it too negative. God rest your soul. My 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 condolences are are to his family. My condolences go to his family. You guys subscribe if you enjoy the content. You like if you want to. I don't even give a shit at this point because YouTube's fucking with my channel. You guys just be safe and make sure you're you're upkeeping yourself. You're 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 taking care of yourself because th this just went to prove just like Kobe, just like Pop, just like this, just like Nipsey, just like X, just like Mac Miller, just like Lil Peep, just to name a few. Juice World, that your days are numbered no matter how powerful you are, no matter how invincible you think you are. You 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 never know when you're gonna go. You guys like you guys subscribe if you want to. Uh, I don't even care about the comment down below how Chadwick or anyone that we've lost in the past year has impacted your life in a positive manner. Um, I'm out.